Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel MI Tutorials. In the last tutorial, we went through the role level security feature which lets you restrict access to certain rows based on the person who has logged into that particular dashboard. But in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to restrict access to a particular column based on the person who has logged into that particular dashboard. For example, you can restrict access to certain sensitive information which is present in your dashboard. In the example that I have over here, I have the sales amount and then I have the sum of profit. So over here, I don't want to show the profit information to all of the users in my team, but I want to restrict that access only to the executive team. However, the other members need not have access to this particular sensitive information. So let's see how we can do this. So let's get started with this tutorial. So the first thing that I will do over here is head to the modeling tab and click on manage roles. So let's create a new role over here and call this role as restrict underscore profit. I'm going to click on save. So once this is done, you will have to install an external tool called as tabular editor. And I will leave a link to that particular uh, website in the description below. So once you've installed that particular software, you will see a new tab in your Power BI desktop called as external tools. And under external tools, you will see something called as tabular editor. So let's click on tabular editor and your dialog box will open up over here. And under roles over here, you will see the roles that we have created, which is restrict underscore profit. And then we also have all the tables that we have in our Power BI file. So let's click on the supermarket grocery sales. This is our fact table over here. And if you want to hide the entire fact table from certain users, let's say you have a geography table, or let's say you have a revenue table, which you want to hide from everybody and give access to only to certain people, you can do that. And scroll down over here, you will see object level security and over here, here, you will see the new role that we created which is restrict profit and under this particular drop down over here you can choose none over here if I save this and go back to my BI and go to the modeling tab and click view as the restrict profit role and click on ok you will see that I don't have access to these visuals which I have created from the sales table and also if you see over here there is the sales table has disappeared so let's go back to our tabular editor and change this back to default with the default is basically read and let's expand the table over here and when you expand the table you will see all the columns listed over here. So let's click on profit and let's scroll down over here and until you find object level security and this is the role that we have created and over here from this drop down let's select none and click on save and let's head back to BI now and click view as and select the role that we have restrict underscore profit and click on OK. The moment you do that, you will see something like this. Something's wrong with this particular visual. And over here, you will see that the profit column has disappeared. And but the other visuals are perfectly visible over here and they will have access to this particular data set. Maybe Microsoft can look at enhancing this particular feature and give us a valuable uh, output over here on this particular visual rather than just saying that something's wrong with this particular visual. I hope the new updates will come in the future. So this is how you can restrict access to a certain table or a column in your Power BI file. So that's it guys in this particular tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. You learned something new today. Please consider subscribing to my channel for more such tutorials.